Tonight at 11, we're learning that firsthand account from that Southern Indiana woman who was rescued from her car by an off duty deputy as water was up to her neck. Our Chase Hal talked tonight with the woman who told him that she is grateful to be alive. Freezing cold flood waters nearly swallowing this SUV just south of Seymour. In the car, Jen Colvin, who was fighting to escape the rising waters. You don't have any idea how terrifying that is to know that you're stuck, that there's nothing you can do. Colvin says she was on her way to deliver a DoorDash order Saturday night before her car slid into a ditch. Next thing she knew, water began to creep in at her feet. I called 911 and um, told the lady on the phone, I was like, I'm trapped in my car and there's water coming in. And there she was like, well, how much water? And I was like, well, it's to my up to it was up to my knees by then. That's when Colvin says she made her way to the back of her car. The water now at her neck and the worst case scenarios going through her mind. That I'm never going to see my kids again. I was never going to see my husband again. I was never going to be able to see my mom and dad. But I wasn't going to be able to tell anybody goodbye. And nobody was going to be able to find me. But someone did find her and just so happened to be Jackson County Sheriff's Deputy Mark Holt, who was off duty. You know, he's just in the right place at the right time and everything worked out to putting me there at that particular time. Both Deputy Holt and Colvin calling it divine, divine intervention. intervention. But whatever you want to call it, Colvin needed to get out of the car and fast. I heard her banging on the window and screaming. And so I jumped in and immediately up above my waist, current and just reacting. Deputy Holt was able to pull Colvin to safety. And as she rocks in her recliner, she can't help but think the woman on her necklace, her grandmother, sent Deputy Holt her way. I've always had this big belief that people have a way of coming back to us. And earlier that day, I saw a red cardinal. And they say that if you see a, a cardinal, it's a visitor from heaven. I honestly believe it was somebody that was, maybe that bird went to that, saw that belief officer and sent him to me. Wow, it's a miracle. It, it really is, and I asked her, you know, did you try to escape? And she yeah. told me she used a metal water bottle and tried to use her fist to break the right. glass, but she she couldn't. So okay. it got me thinking, how how do you get mm. out of a sinking car? And right. AAA said it's like the sure method. So it's stay calm. I got my handy dandy notes right, right here. And then unbuckle your seatbelt or roll down your window if you can right. and exit your vehicle. But as you just saw, exiting your vehicle, is it's hard. And Even, when the water is up to your neck, Holding. Hard to stay calm. Yeah, absolutely. And you're on the phone with 911 right. trying to tell them where you are, where she didn't really know. She was in the middle of nowhere driving a DoorDash order. Right, right. So it was, like you said, I mean, it was nothing short of a miracle. Yeah, and I'm so glad that deputy was there. He was close at the right place at the right time, as you said. Absolutely. All right, Chase, thanks so much.